Just before we start the game three of Pittsburgh and Philly, Pittsburgh's obviously been up to nothing and uh, been able to get the series lead. So the Flyers have made some changes. Of course, we got the Lindros line against the Lemieux line to battle the size. We got Bobby Clark in there um, to go against Crosby. And then uh, you see the bottom six has completely been changed. We've added a lot of new players. Guys that have been good, good, good against Pittsburgh in their career: Couturier, Hartnell, Voracek, Giroux's there. He's still there. And the defense we've added: Ivan Provolov, who's an 88 overall defenseman, uh, higher rank than Shell Sanderson actually. So it shouldn't the team should be better? Let's see how they do in Game Three. Everybody, welcome to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, along with Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Pittsburgh's up in this series here, Ray, but they could really stretch things out with a win here tonight. When you're in a series, it goes really quickly, but it's a long, slow battle, and if you can get out by a couple of games, you really feel good. Both teams seem ready, and they are about to drop the puck on this opening faceoff. Flyers need to win this game to can't go down 0-3. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. And now he moves it to Leclerc. No room for that one to get through. Here he is in front. <laughs> what a save by Bernie. Philadelphia's got it in their own zone. Starting this game off. Takes the feed. Philadelphia's on the attack. Shot that's Score. Rick Tocket. Leclerc able to win a battle there. Just puts the puck in front and Rick Tockett able to get his stick on it. Look at that. Gives the Flyers the early lead. The Flyers seem to be taking advantage of some home cooking tonight. What a great start for them. They come out, the puck hits the ice, and they're by far the most aggressive team. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. By number 20. Right on the doorstep. Can connect. Philadelphia's got it in their own zone. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Oh, smart heads up, Reed. Nice speed at center, moves up ahead now. And a stick in the lane ends that. Look at that, Crosby and Clark. You gotta watch that battle. Come on, Gino. Quick feed to Clark. Slides the puck over. Drives it to the crease. Nice pass. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Cross the blue line, and they'll get that much needed change, Ray. Yeah, they've got to get guys off the ice. They look tired. Now you can get a fresh group on the ice. Pittsburgh's looking to break out. Moves it to Kasparitis. Moves it over to Zubris. Receives the pass. Good forecheck in by Tim Kerr. And he slides it quickly to Gensel. Look at that, Gensel. Rush. Quick shot. Stop. by the blocker. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Slides the puck over to Provorov. Taken by Recky. Scores! Claude Giroux! Giroux? Beautiful pass, Mark Recky. It's really good work offensively as they grind the Flyers adding some new players to their lineup for this game three. From the low slot. Changing up their bottom six. Mark Recchi in the lineup. Ivan Provolov in the lineup. Try to spark this series. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. The Flyers now lead by two. Philadelphia's won the draw and they take possession here in the open ice. And it's a quick pass to Prop. Sends the pass over. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. The Flyers have it behind the cage. Sends it quickly to Howe. Moves the puck. And now he angles it across to Couturier. The Penguins get a hold of the puck. Through center along the wing. 
Can't connect from the point. They take control of it. Turns him away. Takes the pass. Puck grab by Voracek. Scooped up along the wall by Couturier. Here he is on the backhand. And he denied that opportunity. Couturier in the lineup, too. Talk about a goalie's reflexes. You've got to have quick hands to make a glove stop like that. Denied by the goaltender. The Flyers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Oh, and what a hit. By Howe. Takes the feed. He got all of that hit. And he blocks the shot. Great defensive play. Knocked away. Nice zone entry from the middle. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Manages to hang on. And now he tries to get it across to LeClaire. His reflex is on display tonight. Denies him again. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Jumps on top of Hold on to that as the Flyers with some momentum. They needed the stopping. They started getting a scrambly around their zone, and they're looking for some help. Now they can reorganize. Here in the back half of this period, and it's a two-nothing hockey game. The Penguins win it in the defensive zone. Can't connect. Levels them with the hit. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. That pass goes a little sideways. The Penguins look to start the transition game. Here's a chance. Centering pass. Gino's wrong. Oh, man. Kessel's crushed. Moves it quickly over to Thielen. Streaking through center. They go on the attack. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Kessel. To his teammate. And now he moves it quickly to Kasparaitis. Take it along the wall by Kessel. That's close, James. The goaltender ends up feeding the shooter to the post. As that's a, that looks like it's a goal, but it's shut down. As soon as the player winds up, the goaltender moves out, squares up, and makes the save on the slapper. Late goings of this period. Philadelphia's got a 2 nothing lead. Off the draw. A nice job locking up his opponent. Rocks him on the play. Now a quick pass to Trottier. Intercepts it in the neutral zone. Another huge hit. The Penguins get a hold of the puck in their own end. Barber, two them. rough rides there by the time. And he takes a shot, and he makes the save. Caron has been rock solid. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. And sneaks in and grabs possession. Into the offensive end now. Slides the puck across to Orpik. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Nothing doing on that. Here's a shot. Oh, what a stop by Flurry. Oh, great read as he pokes it away. Feeds it to Orpik. And he moves it up to Stevens. Directs it on over to Francis. Denies him. He got all of it. The Flyers gain possession along the wall. Slides it quickly to Recky. The Flyers take it across the blue line. He's flying. Puts it to the front of the net. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Brilliant save. Read it perfectly. Quick feed to Proveron. <laughs> Here's a shot with the stop. The first period Good period for Flyers. As the horn sounds. Well, that's how you start a game. 20 minutes in the books, and it's already 2 0. If you want to show us your accuracy, register now for our shoot to win contest with one lucky fan. We'll have a look at the forward lineup for uh, Philly. I didn't, uh, I, I forgot to show that before the game. They did make quite a few changes. Both teams heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. Jaru makes it 2 0. Okay, let's have a look at the lineup. So, of course, we moved the Legion of Dune line to the top line to battle Lemieux and the Yager's side. And then we got Clark and his crew up against Sidney Crosby's crew. Of course, Reggie Leach got hurt. He's out of the series. And then the bottom six, we kept Zulu, but we changed everybody else. I got, I took out 
Dave Schultz, I took out Wayne Simmons, I took out um, Rick McLeish, and I added all these guys. A whole new line here. And these guys have all played good against the Penguins in their history. Especially this bottom line here. Giroux, of course, has a great history against Pittsburgh. Uh, we put in Ivan Provolov as uh, Samuelson is hurt. He's an 88, so highly ranked defenseman. He's been added to the team. So, and then also we put Darian Hatcher, who's a 90 as well, to the top line to battle that size of Mario Lemieux with Lindros. And then you got Mark Howe, who fits in well against Crosby. So a little bit of a coaching adjustment that the Flyers have done here. You can see we got a couple injuries there. This is a big one, obviously, Reggie Leach. <clears throat> Let's go. Let's see if I can crack this puzzle. A chance for both teams to refuel. They are back on the ice, and period number two is about set to go. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is oh, shit. We are underway. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? Been Mario in this Lemieux game so runs over Desjardins twice, like this, this sending him to the bench without a helmet. something that everybody in sports longs for. Hope here, Ray. Hope, a chance. Hey, the it's game. here. Something. Time isn't score. the enemy First yet. Scored by number seven, assisted by number 10, and by number 56. Time of the goal. Six minutes. Good reach to the stick yeah, to knock the puck away. Rest the Penguins get a hold of it. Here's a short pass to Russ. Oh, he'll feel that oh, one. He's Big time right defensive there. play. Moves it quickly over to Recky. Philadelphia's got it on the offensive zone. Silvers has it in the defensive end. Crushed by Recky. Play it, man. Fuck. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. <coughs> the Flyers 
have been the better team, leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. And another stop! Through the offensive zone and behind the net now. Unbeatable! Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stop before the puck is cleared away. Pittsburgh's got it along the wall. What a stop as he puts up the fire! Cardinal's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. Pittsburgh's looking to break out of their own end. The Penguins will play it from the defensive zone. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Picked up along the wall by Howe. Philadelphia's got the puck against the boards. Nice head. The okay. Penguins gain possession in their own end. And that pass goes awry. Quick pass to Forge. pass. They could not break Philadelphia's through. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. Taken by Latang. Quick feed to Crosby. Slides the puck ahead to Kessel. And he slides it quickly to Latang. And a strong defensive effort to get in front of that. Hammers the shot. Stops him with the glove. Pushes it across to Trocek. Here they are on the attack. Sends it across. What a save. Oh, with the blocker. What a stop by Flurry. Sings lugging the puck. Gains the zone on the left wing. Takes a shot. Close save. And he handles it with ease. Oh man, Yager looking to go for that shot instead of the pass because he's trying to catch Perron, but Perron on his game. Just talk it. Is that, uh, this is a Latang block shot. More than half the frame has been played here. The Flyers are up 3 1. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. Forbes got it in the offensive zone. Pittsburgh's got control of the puck. Moves it to Trotsky. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Penguins can't get breakouts through here. The Flyers doing he a good job. Let's get physical on that play. He should carry it through. Rust's got it to the side. On the doorstep. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Picked up along the boards by Trotsky. Can't find his man. And the goalie leaves his crease to play the puck. Pushes it across to Gonchar. Francis plays it against the boards. Couldn't complete the play. He grabs the puck here at the point. Come the Flyers on. take possession in the defensive end. Philadelphia's got the puck against the half wall. Scooped up along the wall by Brock. Takes a shot. And that was stopped. The Flyers have it against the wall. And they can't convert to the play. Here's a short pass to Clark. Oh, uh, puck doesn't get there. So crowded in front of the goaltender. And we've got a two-on-one. Great save. Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter. There's nowhere for the puck to go. Out front. Can't connect. Moves into the slot. Answered the call on that play. Here he is. Wrist on that. Love the defensive effort to get in front of that. Oh. And the sound well, of the running guys over here. Up for period number two in what has been a tightly contested affair. Fans, a portion of tonight's proceeds will fund the Children's Playroom at City Hospital, providing a safe, fun environment for kids visiting long-term care patients. Like to learn more or to donate, please visit our team website. Don't go anywhere. Third period is coming up, and it's coming up next.
chance to nice him in front. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Pass right on the doorstep. Can't connect. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. And now he moves it to Hatcher. Directed over to Trocek. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Here's a blast! Oh, a he shot. Beat, but puts it wide by not very much. This is a guy that knows how to score. He just misses the net by a narrow margin here. On the attack along the boards. Come Close on, save, he shot. It looks simple. Good tonight, especially offensively here in this third period. Philadelphia has won the draw. Up along the wing. Oh, that hurt from here. He didn't take anything out of that hit. He delivered it really as hard as he could. Oh, goodness. Slides the puck across to Rust. Intercepted. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a Come on, like man. This. We got to get our offense going. This has been not a good offensive game for us. The, the Flyers have made some adjustments. Come on, go, 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 go. Ah, uh, fuck, man. Pass that. I'm trying to pass it. I mean, that's not a weak backhand. That's what you're playing for, those two on ones. And try to bury those plays, but we don't even get the shot that we want. Time's running out. And he gets one back. This fifth. This really good finds good him. Work here as they move it around. The opening is for the guy in the low slot, but he's by himself and he's able to one time at home. God. Pittsburgh's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the body language. They know they've got a chance. Puck scooped up by Murphy, and he gets pummeled. He tried to protect himself by getting his stick up, but he didn't get it up far enough. He got rattled out of his hands. Now he's got to chase it down. 54 seconds. Well, we figured these two rivals don't like each other, and they put that on display here. This period has been one of the most physical we've seen in a long time. The centermen glide into position. Pittsburgh's got it, and they're on the attack. That pass doesn't go. Puck picked up by Prop. Punks it away at his own end. Move to the middle. Quick pass. To oh, man. Right. The, post. the Flyers quickly started to look at the tablets on the bench to see if that puck hit the post and went in or crossed the line. It didn't. And the lead will remain the same. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. The Flyers are getting penalized for slashing far tighter standards than it used to be on this penalty and that one's a pretty clear penalty game's better for it though Ray I guess sure <laughs> well this gives us our first chance to take a look at the team's power play unit they've been trying to push for the tying goal now they're going to get an opportunity on the power play beats it down oh, yeah. turn that one aside looking to make something happen in the offensive oh, Yager. he scores Oh, the power play comes through. They move the puck nicely, and they're able to capitalize on the extra man. Ties it up. On the power play, a big mistake for Philly. You don't want to give Penguins a power play. So Yager is able to tie the game. He's able to work his Yager knocked the down the defenseman there. Kevin ha or Darian Hatcher. So the goalie can't catch up to it. That's what left him wide open in front. Look at that. Hatcher's behind the net. And Yager's in front of the net. And then the puck is in the net. 
Pittsburgh's goal has set up a thrilling finish here in this third period. Really good work to get the game back to level. Now they have to continue to push to find the winner. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Solid check to slow him down. Handles the puck. Let's see what you got. The Penguins see, they're trapping. And now he passes up to Singh. That's a Crushed. big time hit along the wall. It is James. I love the way he used the angle. He took away all the ice. And now he angles it across to Leclerc. Big time play right there. Back to the point it goes. Steps into it. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Takes the feed. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Philadelphia is ready to go on the attack. The Penguins have it from their own end. Slides it over with pace to Murphy. Trying to get it down the ice. And that's a big clear at this stage of the game. Yeah, they're all big now. That puck's near the blue line. It's got to get out. Latang's got it in the defensive end. Oh, great read on the play. Quick feed to Leclerc. From the slot, wrist shot, the blocker saved by Fleury. High quality chance, high quality save. Looks to pass it to Mullins. Wax it into the offensive zone. The Flyers have it behind the cage. Scoops up the puck now and tries to make a diagonal pass to Lindros. And the puck escapes the zone and they'll be forced to tag up. Here's a chance right in the slot. Pittsburgh's regained possession of the puck. Oh boy, here comes a three on one. Nice reflex by the goaltender to get his glove on that one. Moves it to Thielen. To the low slot. The Penguins have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Drills them. Sends it over. Gets an attack with the stick, and the referees don't like it. Big time stop. Let's get the call here. Thielen's getting called for slashing. That's a bad reaction. He's beat. He's there in a position. He just turns around and whacks. Just a good old-fashioned hack. Another power play opportunity coming up here. The Penguins win the faceoff. Oh! Game saver there. Come on, Gino. Shitty pass. Offside is the call that will have a face off just outside the offensive zone. Perron with a great save. Everybody likes to think of themselves as a little bit of a clutch performer. If you score at this time of the year, you are that. Here in the late going to the frame, we got a tie game. Pittsburgh's won it. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. And he's ridden off the puck. Here's a short pass to Clark. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Moves it quickly over to Giroux. Good battle along the boards for the puck. And it's a quick pass to Crosby. Crosby, game he's on his stick. Scores! Sidney Crosby kills Philadelphia once more time. With five seconds to go, puts the Penguins up by a goal. On the verge of going up 3-0 on this. Yeah, look at these idiots. Look at them. Unbelievable. What a bad penalty for Therian to take. Just a poor shit penalty for Therian to take. But in the dying seconds, they Crosby with five seconds to go, to go roofs it. I love it. I love it. The Penguins lead it late in this third period. Puck is dropped and play resumes. Feeds it over to Recky. Look out, score! No! Are you kidding? What? I don't believe it. I cannot believe it. The defense just splits. 
In the dying seconds, they tie this oh, game up. And then, fucking Flurry doesn't play that rebound. I, I can't believe they tied it. I cannot believe they tied it. Play set to resume with the face off ready to go. Oh my god. Oh my god, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I can't believe he tied it. Penguins big guns got them back in this game, got the we'll lead for them. Break. And then with six, five seconds to go, you're down by a goal with face off at center ice and you tie the game. Unbelievable. Flyers can stay out of the box, they would have won this game already. But here we go, next goal wins. Flyers have to win this game. Let's find out. Overtime is underway. Ferraro, next goal wins. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. Slides oh, to it. nice play. Uh oh, my net's empty. Back door. The Penguins look to start the transition. Where are you going, Mario? Quick Go to the net. To the Let me you on a break. Desjardins so caught him. In. Nice play. Taken along the wall by Trocek. The Flyers move the puck in the defensive zone. And he can't hang on after that hit. We'll get a face off as the puck skips out into the bench. Crosby's been able to put this team on his back. He's among the league leaders in points in this playoff season. Crosby back out there against Clark now, Field that matchup. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Here's a chance out front. Oh boy. Clark. Oh, right in front. Get it out. Get it out. Scores. Fuck. wasn't good defensive, my, I felt like my D was just running away from the net. It's like, oh, come back, come back. That whole shift, good shift for the Clark line as they finish it. Bill Barber scores the overtime winner. Getting the Flyers back into this series, 2-1 now. I thought this was it right here. Five seconds left, Crosby scores to get the lead, like, come on. The story just writes itself. And then Recky ties. I don't know what my D was doing there. C's parted. And Recky, one of the new players, comes in handy and ties the game. See, where's the fanfare from the guys on the ice? They just scored an overtime goal and then Clark sets him up and he skates off like it's nothing. They need to fix that. Like right here, watch. Scores and watch Clark. Oh yeah, no big deal. Like, dude, you just scored a huge goal, the biggest goal of your season to save your season. You be jumping up and down. But Mark Recky, former Penguin, scores a huge goal to tie it up. And the Penguins finally lose. First time they've lost, they had a 21 game winning streak going back to the regular season. Snapped. I could feel it in the game too. Pittsburgh felt slow. They felt like the momentum from the opening faceoff. You know, when you're in a, when you're in a playoff series and you play the first road game, it sometimes happens like that. It's not bad. We stole a win last game against them, and then they ended up coming back and stealing a win in this game. So it's playoff hockey. Still up 2-1 in the series. Let's see what happens next game.